Today I'm going to show you guys how I organize my crafts 2020. My first step is to use a one inch binder to hold any extra printables. Over the years I've collected a lot of printables and haven't used all of them. So I hold them in these card holders and page covers in this binder. It's really great because it's all very neat and it just looks very nice and organized. To hold my pens, pencils, rulers, and other things, I put this cardboard box I created and put it to fit my craft desk. It's really great because I'm not worried about getting pencil ad or pen or something on it, and it holds it very well. I have quite a lot of markers. So this is my permanent marker collection, and there's just a bunch of Sharpies and whatnot in there. So I put them in a simple Tupperware container and it fits them perfectly. For my dry erase and non-permanent markers, like my washable Crayola markers, I just simply put them in a pencil pouch and put it right under my craft desk. So this is my main way of sorting stuff. This is a crafting cart and it's kind of like a mini chest cart, if that helps you. <laughs> For my beads drawer, I just put them in these little containers and some Tupperware containers. So it's great because I can see through the tops of most of them. This is my wood, styrofoam, and straws container. I then have my miscellaneous drawer, which I don't really want to go through. And my glitter container, which is very sparkly. I have a bunch of glitter glues and glitter in there. And then I have my glue container, which could be a little, like, sorted but it's glue, what can you say? Lastly, I have my tools container, which holds a bunch of tools. I hope this video helps everyone in sorting their craft stations. Be sure to comment down below on any crafts you'd like to see me do, and like this video. Make sure to subscribe and get crafting.